Module 3, Basic Commands and Fundamental Behaviors. Lesson 2, Down and Stay Still Commands. Welcome to the second lesson of Module 3 in the PAW Trainer course on dog training. In this module, we will continue exploring specific commands that are essential for controlling your dog. In this lesson, we will learn the down and stay commands. 1. Down command. The down command is useful for getting your dog into a lying down position. 1. This command can be used when you want the dog to lie down on their mat or in situations that require a more relaxed position. Here's how to teach the down command to your dog. Start with your dog in a sitting position. Hold a treat in your hand and position your hand with the palm facing down, just in front of the dog's nose. Slowly move your hand downward towards the floor, encouraging the dog to follow with their gaze and nose. As the dog lowers their nose towards the floor, clearly say the command down. When the dog lies down completely, praise them enthusiastically and offer the treat as a reward. 1. Stay still command. Similar to the stay command, the stay still command is crucial for teaching your dog to remain in their current position without moving. This command is useful in situations when you want the dog to stay in place, even if you move away from them. Here's how to teach the stay command to your dog. Start with your dog in a sitting or lying down position. Clearly say the command stay still while simultaneously raising your hand with the palm facing the dog, as if making a stop gesture. Take a step backward or sideways, creating a short distance between you and the dog. Maintain eye contact with the dog, and if they stay in the position without moving, wait for a few seconds, praise them, and offer a reward. If the dog moves, repeat the stay still command and return to the original position. Repeat until the dog remains still. 1. Practice and reinforcement. As with all commands, practice is essential to reinforce the desired behavior. Regularly practice with your dog, gradually increasing the duration of the down and stay commands. Remember to use positive reinforcements such as treats and praise to motivate your dog to maintain the positions. Be patient and consistent in teaching the down and stay commands to your dog. Training takes time and dedication, but with consistent practice and a positive approach, you can achieve positive results. Remember to adapt the training to your dog's abilities and pace, always rewarding their progress and maintaining a positive attitude. During training sessions, remember to use clear and consistent commands, along with nonverbal signals such as gestures or facial expressions. This will help your dog better understand what is expected of them and respond appropriately. Furthermore, it is important to emphasize that dog training requires patience and consistency. Each dog has their own learning pace, so don't be discouraged if it takes time to achieve desired results. Keep practicing regularly, both in dedicated training sessions and by integrating the teachings into your dog's daily life. In the next lesson, we will explore additional commands and useful techniques for dog training. Remember to apply what you've learned consistently and enjoy the training journey with your faithful companion. Good luck and continue to build a strong bond with your dog through positive training.